mean, Location Guru is about location enablement for carriers. So what we do is we create uh, softwares and solutions for complete LBC ecosystem development for operators. What you know, the solutions consist of you know a location component, LBS middleware, and a series of LBS applications and services. So one of the such applications we are looking at is the MySphere application. So MySphere is all about your you know uh, make in your social network experience turned and filtered for you to suit your kind of choices and preferences and contents. What, what otherwise is happening these days is there is so much downpour into your social networks, Facebook, Twitter and everything that you know it's hardly making any sense, you hardly you know have get a chance to go through all the contents that you see. So what MySphere does for you is it takes into account your profile, your preferences, your interests, what your online and social activities that you do with social networks and filter all your social network contents and other contents as well as you know blogs, news. Uh, any other third party feeds that are available and presents all this information to you in a meaningful way that it will make sense for your choices, not you know everybody and anybody throwing contents onto your social network site. In addition, it has the regular social network stuff as well. You can look at your Facebook, Twitter timeline and it will show you, you know, what people are on your Facebook and Twitter. But more important part of it is it's filtering the part of the content, mashing up and you know and presenting it back to you in a, in a, as a series of uh, things that are, uh, you know, that are relevant for you. So it's, we, just, uh, we just go back to... So it classifies the content basically as three different things. One is... One is uh, people, other is places, and third is buzz. So you know, people meaningful people for you. I mean, there are people in your social network, and then their friends is what it, 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 it's trying to capture. People and more also important is people who are close to you. You know, your location is also taken into account. Then the places. If you know, uh, if you are near a particular location, then you know, based on your choices. Let's say if you are a fan of a continental for you to figure out continental restaurants nearby. If you are, you know, more into movies, it will suggest you, you know, interesting movie theatres or if you are into some, some classical music, it will share, uh, you know, those kind of events happening around you. And then comes the buzz, you know, which is what's happening around news, tweets, blogs, feeds, events that are all happening. Once you have figured out, you know, something that is of your particular interest, it, 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 it connects with you with that content either by, you know, either take, giving you directions to reach that person, uh, you know, or a place, or, you know, uh, letting you go to the website of a particular theatre or, you know, how to, about getting you, letting you buy the tickets and so forth. You know, you can configure a variety of social network accounts with it and then it will fetch content from all of those accounts and filter and present that for you. It's an application, you will get it onto your phone, you download it and you put it on your phone, you configure your social network accounts with it. You see that this is my Facebook ID and password, this is my Twitter ID and password. It starts from there, from there it catches, captures all this information and you know combines and mashes it up with your preferences, profile and presents it to you. Uh, it's going to you know launch on our Android app store and uh, iPhone App Store. It will uh, cost you 150 rupees a month. It will be on smartphones. This is an application being unveiled in this conference. In fact, we are uh, going to operators and OEMs. So you know, handset OEMs want differentiating applications. So those will be our customers will be embedding those uh, in the application into the handsets. And operators, you know, also again want to launch differentiating services. We'll be doing that and. You know, for uh, uh, application, will also be available for download on the uh, Apple, I, I, uh, Apple App Store and Android Market, so and so.